This is the first 420 where we finally understand why fresh marijuana smells like a skunk. For a long time, we've known that over 200 volatile chemicals contributed to that smell. Most of those chemicals are terpenoids. These are the kinds of molecules that give us flavors or scents like cinnamon, ginger, cloves, menthol, all kinds of stuff. Thing is, none of those terpenoids smell skunky. So a team of eight chemists looked into this using a custom two-dimensional gas chromatograph hooked up to a time-of-flight mass spectrometer, a flame ionization detector, and a sulfur chemiluminescence detector. The paper's linked in the description if you want to read it, but it turns out that the skunkiness they found was not a terpenoid, but a whole new family of volatile sulfur compounds, mainly 3-methyl-2-butene-1-thiol and 3-methyl-2-butenyl-acetothioate. Then they went back and looked at cannabis plants and found that those compounds increase significantly during the end of the plant's flowering stage, max out during curing, and then drop way off after just 10 days of storage. And all that means that 